Do you know who Alexander Dugin is? Of course, he's a bad guy, put in agenda. However, I once read his sociological essays. One was about the dying logos of the modern world. It's already dead and buried. However, mm, I was supposed to talk about different things. What is the final dream fantasy of modern females, and likewise males? Some may think that it is the dark thread, or the nice guy type, or this or that. No, females dream of a kitsch Dionysian golden boy that is both a deranged, xenosexual, polymorphic, idiot, ultra-relativist swine. At the same time, is an ultra-masculine man on a white horsey that comes and saves their sexual fantasies from being spoiled. A bit like a Marvel hero but more of a completely disastrous, completely labile in psychiatric terms, completely fluid, at the same time strong, idol. Woo! Yes, sexual fantasies of modern spoiled female fulfilled. Now, how about males? From observation from about uh, 1980s, 1990s maybe, the whole internet in 85% of it was driven by porn. Mm -hmm. So if we intuit this social solid state intelligence, it is like um, a sukuba harvesting minds, souls and hearts. So the prime dream of an infantile male is a turbo-dominant succuba, a luxurious bitch that is serviced by her acolytes or the... <laughs> how is it called in Wormwood? The gentleman co-ops? Mm, um, little gnomes? No. Goblins. Goblins and the turbo succuba, the turbo bitch. Yes, that is the dream of every modern point infantile boy. So, what's the problem with narcissism, consumerism, uh, individualism without individuation, without responsibility, is that it is all immature. It is infantilism combined with narcissism, combined with weird uh, claims, and we can marry the figures of the modern world or the pseudo Dionysus, the kitschy golden boy, the deranged uh, whore man, plus the ultra dominant succuba that is serviced by her acolytes, it's spoiled, materialistic, and uh, exploitative towards her little uh, goblets, hobgoblins. So, what happens if we combine this turbo pair? Well, you can visit a swine house, an industrial scale swine house. And all of a sudden, you realize that if you drag the pigs in the swine house with plenty of drugs and they go insane, you've got those two figures worshipped by males and females in the modern world. And this is how the world ends with Venus fallen. Where is the diatomic triad of Eros, Philia, Agape, the beautiful, beautiful love, the flirt, the erotica? Well, it went down the drain, down the sewers of feces. So, enjoy it. I'd rather be a psycho than I am. Thank you.